Yeah, hi everybody, it's Peter from uh, Prado Places Oz. I recently posted a video about fitting these uh, Titan drawer system, but uh, the trickiest part of it is actually fitting the bump stops. So I thought I'd make a shorter edited video just on how to fit the bump stops because the instructions are quite poor on how to do it. And I thought I could uh, shoot some film and show you how to do it a little bit easier than the instructions. So here we go. Okay, now the really fiddly part of the installation is installing the bumper stops. So these stop the drawers actually sliding out. And there's a couple of holes at the back of each drawer on both sides that look like this. Okay, so these are the actual bumper stops. They look like this. There's a little buffer on the end there. Now what you have to do is these have to be screwed on here like this. Now if you were doing it from the outside like this, it would be really simple, but you've got to do it from the inside because otherwise you can't put the drawer in. So you've got to get the drawer two thirds in, locate the screw holes which are in the felt on that side, somehow hold this in place while the drawer is in and there's very little space and then screw in the Allen key. Okay, so these are the bumper stops and they fit between the side of the casing and the actual metal of the drawer itself. Now the problem is if you were fitting these while you had the drawers out, it would be really easy. But the problem is you can't do that because if you fit them while the drawer's out, you can't put the drawer back in. So what the instructions say is you've got to have the drawer two thirds of the way in and then fit them then whilst holding the drawer in. And that's actually quite tricky. So what you have to do is uh, put your finger on uh, the bump stop with your left hand. Uh, you can see there's a little sort of ready bit that goes to the back. And then at the same time, whilst you're doing that, you've got to um, screw from the inside of the drawer. And it's an Allen key, so it's not even a screwdriver. So it's actually quite fiddly. So, and uh, you have to put one on each side. You, so you can see there's the back of the drawer. Uh, there's the side of the casing. So you don't have very much space, but you've got to actually hold these with your finger. You can see here's the one on the other side. Uh, you've got to actually hold this with your finger whilst at the same time, tightening the two screws inside the drawer with an allen key um, but this is how where you have to do it unfortunately do not screw them on whilst you've got the drawer out which is the easy way to do it because if you do that you won't be able to get the drawer in again but if you don't put these in your drawers will just pull straight out and uh, you could actually have everything falling out on you if you pull the drawer out quite quickly all right hope that helps Okay, so I hope that little snippet helps. Um, they are they are extremely fiddly. In fact, I've uh, cut my knuckles trying to put these in because some of that metal is very sharp, so be careful doing it. The instructions are not that great. Uh, I must admit, there's no pictorial instructions to show you how to do that. So I hope that video helps a little bit. Um, if you like this video or videos like this, please subscribe, please uh, give it a like. If you want to watch the full installation video, I'll... Um, put a link up here somewhere and by the magic of uh, technology hopefully you'll be able to see the link there uh, thanks for watching and as I say please subscribe and support the channel thanks very much